All right, yo, what is going on, everybody? It's your boy, Mr. DDG94, back with another reaction video. Today, we're going to react to the greatest interceptions in NFL history. Without further ado, let's check it out. Empty backfield, here comes the pressure on Henny, and this pass is intercepted. Oh, wow, that was nice. Deflection, bringing it back for the Saints. Inside the 10 yard line. Oh. Drop is in for the touchdown. And then takes it to the end zone. And look at Chad Henney, hit as he throws the football. The pressure from Jonathan Vilma, not enough to disrupt the throw. But Tracy Porter, a nice play in man to man coverage. And Darren Sharp with the beneficiary as the free safety. First down. Rivers. Of course. Oh, Only Philip Rivers, right? Second one. How about that for some hand eye coordination? And Brandon Carr gets his second pick of the night. One of the most overrated quarterbacks. Oh, wow. Batted him in the air and picked off by Simon. And John Simon is going to coast into the end zone. Unbelievable effort. And he's got his hands full tonight. Set both going. Oh. Thomas has it looped out of his hands. Who's got the possession on the sideline? Nelson took it out of his hands, and they say Cincinnati ball. Julius Thomas had it. Nelson ripping it out of his hands, trying to keep his feet in bounds. They rule he secured it. It will be reviewed for the moment. Bengal ball. What a great effort by Reggie Nelson. This will be challenge for the next couple minutes i'm sure of that mike but what an effort by nelson to rip the ball away from julius thomas terrific second down and seven Fulmer with the block at the right tackle in time for brady who's got ridley as bobble and intercepted on the reflection krasinski gets the ball turnover burris first and ten let's nobody home Great. It was a it looked like it was. That's Pat Lee getting up. That would be another turnover. Damn. It's another interception. Yeah, look at that score. And Castle is screaming at his wide receiver. He was like, you're supposed to go deep. You're supposed to be deep, not the defensive back. That's a great catch. That was a great catch. Great interception. Great catch. Arizona had the number one rated offense in the NFL last season. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. He's intercepted. Brandon Flowers taking it to the house. That was and nice. San Diego that was a takes good one. the first lead of the That night. was a good one. I know that. That was a good one. Oh, nice. Oh, Interception. Nice job by the Patriots. Well, that was uh, Greg Ross LeBlanc. Kid out of Florida Atlantic with a nice pick. Each side. Terrible pass. And almost picked at the 21 yard line and picked. Suggs comes up with it. And then watch Suggs. I think he catches it between his legs. It's there. I don't think it ever hit the ground. Splash plays. I out. Did it hit the ground? I don't think it did. Amazing. First splash play with his knees. Great receivers in that situation, they come and attack the ball. Goodwin is waiting for the ball to come to him as opposed to coming through the defensive back or around the defensive back to attack. And look at Kirkpatrick on getting both feet down in back. He got the it. Catch. First play from scrimmage. Oh, yeah, back in the good old days. You're the man sport. Garcia. Off the hands of Owens into the air and picked off Floyd Smith. That good old man sport. Damn, look at that score. Oh, my God. They finally come out, get the ball in the hands of their superstar, Carol Owens. Going to make a nice adjustment, working on points. Ball's thrown in there, he's going to one-hand it, and somehow pop the thing straight up in the air for an interception. Payton back when he was and on the Colts. Oh, wow. And it's intercepted. Intercepted at the two-yard line. And watch 
vicious one-handed catch by Eric Weddle with a face full of Jeff Saturday. Butterfingers. Saturday's blocking That ain't Peyton fault. That's homie fault. That's Butterfingers. Yeah, Tony Romo known for this. Yeah. What, would be, what, what would it be without Tony Romo? What would, it be, what would this video be without Tony Romo on here? Come on, man. And Philip Cece has a touchdown, and Romo is saying, hold everything. Wait a second. There was a juggle. Coughlin comes out under the field. Did it hit his foot, or, or did it bounce? Oh, I don't know. Take a look at this. It's off Blitton's off foot, off right the foot. to Phillips, and that, it has to be reviewed it's upstairs, be review, yeah. and it will be. Well, his hand, the back no of his foot, about it. never touches the turf. No doubt about it. Overturn the call on the field, which was incomplete. Phillips is going to get the interception. And the top has never thrown a pass in his NFL career in the regular season until now. Ball batted in the air, pulled him up, almost got there. Troy Palomalo. The Steelers think they have it. McFadden reads the route, drives it very well. And once Palomalu goes out, oh wow. my gosh. What an athletic play by Palomalu. He's going to show him around and then again forget that. Second down and five. Here's Collins back to pass again. Going deep down field. Oh, you tried the wrong one, bro. One you tried the wrong one, one bro. Troy Palomaro, you tried the wrong one. You tried the wrong one. He's made five straight Pro Bowls. Kenny Britt, the rookie, coming down the field, and he's going to say, nobody ever did this in college, Trevor. He even pushed off on the play. Watch this. He's going to push him in the back and still come away with the interception and jump up and get ready to run. Rivers. Open. Jackson. Nope. Oh. Palomaro almost makes the interception. That they play on the field as if he did. I thought it hit the ground. Colorado's still on his feet. He's able to shake three three hits and still going. Ah, he's hitting the ice. Let's see if it's a pick. Unbelievable. What a catch. Wow. I don't know. Still not sure. He got his hand underneath there. Take another look. I think he got it. It's, it's unclear. It's not clear. Good old Dave Barton, my sport. Good catch. We gone. We going to the residence, big fella. We going to the residence. Back when this was a man sport, they got the money in. Had to be a man who played this sport back then, baby. Oh, man. That would be a That was just incredible. That was great. That's going to make a highlight reel. Mamula reaches up to bat the pass, hooks it with his left hand, and pulls it in. Oh, fine. Remaining in the hand. Oh. Intercepted by George Martin. That was a terrible pass. Good old days, boy. That was a terrible pass. 20. Terrible pass. Good old days, though. Those the bad ones. Oh, man, this is the good Daddy old Moore days, ain't it? Tennis for Dudley. Warren Marr, flat on the ground. Oh, he got the ball it. Up in the air. Got back up on his feet. And while everyone thought the pass was incomplete, Marr raced in for another score. This we back in the again. good old days, the CTE days. This is when your health didn't matter, boy. This is when health didn't matter, boy. It was like you There's play. You play this Lyra game, you Dudley. play this game. You, you know the, the rules, the you know what you signed up for. Up this is the good days. This is the good old days when everybody was catching CTE. And the two of them can't pick a little check down pass. It's a fake, and it still got intercepted. Kozlowski thought he had it. And then he good was old days, boy. It was a mighty good point. Smith intercepted that ball. Kozlowski thought he had it in his hands on the pass from Moore. And what a hit by Jackson leading to the interception by Smith. This is a man's sport. Moore throws it 
ball pretty well under pressure. But wow, does Dexter Jackson make a play? Had me and Miami play this sport. I understand me had to be Dexter Jackson man. knocked his own chin strap off. The Bears just haven't given him anything to do that. Oh, don't even set you. Don't even set you. Yeah. Fuck the Packers. Off the hands of Fuck the puck ass the Packers. Hell yeah. A low throw and. It's video good. Good. Hey, interception. Boy, boy, the video good. Hey, it's good ass wondering video, what boy. the heck happened. The low throw. Terrible. You know, tough catch there Terrible for Donald throw. Driver. You saw the driver was being kind of casual about it after he was unable to catch it. Not a ball that you would expect to be intercepted, yeah, especially considering on that one. You know, how much space he had between him and Lance Briggs, but Briggs being able to make then the reflection for the interception. That's Aaron Rodgers' fault on that one. That's a terrible pass. Oh, wow. Great catch. Great catch. Back-to-back picks. That's a great catch. Butts here in the first half, and now back-to-back -back interceptions. Grimes. That's a great catch. 40-inch vertical leap stabs out with one hand. Ooh, that's cool on Megatron too. Oh my God! Don't remind me of this one, bro. You at the one yard line. All you had to do was run it into the goddamn field and you throw a fucking slant pass. What the? <laughs> oh my God. We 11 minutes into the video. We already got to go through this. Oh, this was the dumbest shit I've ever seen in my life. Pete Carroll has to be the dumbest coach I have ever seen. Super Bowl. Game is on the line. You're down to the final seconds of the fourth quarter. You have Marshawn Lynch in the backfield. And you run a slant. You run a slant, my nigga. Pete Carroll, you gotta be the dumbest coach I have ever seen. One yard line. One yard line. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. They can't contain him as is. You throw a fucking slant. All because this nigga didn't want to talk to the media. I ain't gonna put this on Seattle. I'm gonna just put this on Pete Carroll. Pete Carroll, you deserve this. You deserve this. This right here, yes. Pete Carroll, you deserve this, brother. You the reason. You the reason. You the reason, my brother. You deserved it. Pass is intercepted at the goal line by Malcolm Butler. Unreal. They try to pick play out. They tried to go here, but he beats him to the punch. And I'm sorry, but I can't believe the call. I cannot believe the call. You've got Marshawn Lynch in the backfield. You've got a guy that's been borderline unstoppable in this part of the field. I can't believe the call. He's already had one interception, which he returned for a touchdown this year against the Rams. And now Newton's going to air it out, looking down the field to Corey Brown. Oh. And he goes up into the air and just wrestles that thing away. I think that's no, they're saying the reception or on it. They are. The two officials getting together. It looked like Brown had a hold of that football. Back there with Tandy. You be the judge. I thought ties go to the offense. I did too. You see Corey Brown across the middle. Cam puts it up there to give him a chance. But Tandy gets underneath it, wrestles ball. it away. They, they both, yeah, It comes yeah. down with the football. You see how he got underneath the Brown? Brown has it first. Tandy gets underneath. 
and when the arm takes it away, that's just a good. That. That, that's that's some that, that, that's that's stacked to his right. That's just some good uh, defense right there. That's some good defense right there. He throws right a little high, but Ross Ooh, comes down. Okay. Up in the air and it's picked off. This could go for the Bills. Go all the way. And with it, it will. It's Ron Brooks. Ooh. See you later. Well, sometimes it's better to be uh, lucky than good. This time the Bills are. Jeremy Ross is going to go up here, have the ball, but when he comes down, it never touches the ground. That should be an interception. Yep. I would not call that a fumble recovery because he, Jeremy Ross never had possession of it. And he'll start from the six. Taylor looking for the tight end of the play. And he makes the catch. And then he came out of his hands and it's taken away. Devon Kennard. Rolling on the field is an interception. First down. So Kennard takes it away from Clay. Trying to really feature Charles Clay in this game. It looks like he's got it. And as they go to the ground, he loses possession. They rule interception, so it's a turnover. So it will be reviewed to see if Devon Kennard stayed in bounds as he wrestled that ball away. A quick snap, end zone throw, battle for, and oh, intercepted. Terrible pass. Newman. Terrible pass. With his second pick of the day. Good defense, Terry Pass. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That's, that's some shit right there. Good ass. That's that's some good ass def that's some good ass defense right there, boy. Came out of nowhere to get that one. For real. Look where he jumped from. Demarius is gonna is gonna just run a quarter route, but it's just the eyes of Peyton Manning. He just looks over here the entire time. And Woodson just drifts to that side of the field. He takes off. He's able to undercut it. Look where he jumped from. That's a good ass catch. That's a good ass. What a catch. He's won the two previous encounters against his younger brother. That's some good ass defense right there, boy. Trying to find Randall and the Broncos say they came up with it. This Harris. A diving attempt off the deflection is broken up by Tony Carter. Watch the ball now. Carter does a great job stepping in front of this one. And does it hit his foot? Yes, oh, it hits the back oh, okay, of his feet. Oh, okay, okay. Never hit the ground and lands right in the arms of Chris Harris. Two free agent players for the Denver Broncos. Fakes motion now comes back to the bottom and here they come again. Philip Rivers, interception. And it's picked by 47, Chris Conti, returning it deep inside the 10. And boom, I saw this, I saw Tim James breaking for the ball, just like that. He has the right to go for the ball. Receiver gets caught up in his feet. And then what a nice play by Chris Conte. The nice ball skills. Wow. Peyton Manning has to move him around because he has to be his go-to guy tonight. Throw down and oh, yeah. Throw it up. Manning goes down as he gets it away. Oh. And that is a phenomenal one-handed interception by Cromarty. That's a good-ass catch. You're always hearing about a guy who's a great athlete. Well, I tell you what, when you watch that run back last week, when you watch what he does tonight, when you watch that pick, that is a great athlete. That's a good-ass catch. <laughs> Damn, that score though. Quentin Dips may have come up with it. Yes, he has. That that's score a throw though. That he has to make, and that's a catch that a really has to has to has to get in. I mean, that's not. It's behind him. It gets in on him quick, but you've got to find a way to make the tough ones. Catch to make 
make sure the feet are down off the rebound. The ball was intended for Decker. It got broken up by Stuckey. I think it hit right into Eric Decker's chest. Stucky had a hand in there. Stucky did get oh, his hand. It is a wonderful job by Butler staying in bounds. Alrighty. Cousins. Here's it out. Jacob. Oh. What a play by McCain. Intercepted. Bryce McCain. What an effort. Turnover, Washington. I'm sure this one's going to be reviewed here. Oh, wow. Whether he had possession before he goes That's out of bounds. Right That's good. He's got it right there, but I'm not sure he has it the entire way to the ground. The effort is there as he takes it away from Garcon. Has it pinned to his shoulder. What's coming? Hold up. And D'Angelo Hall snatches it away. Y'all playing and with the wrong one. Down the Goddamn Jay Cutler. He got a block. And Hall will go the distance. Jay oh, Cutler. Oh Carlos Rogers here is going to come on the blitz. And as a result of that, Cutler's throwing off his back foot. And it's a ball he just threw in behind. He, Jay Cutler. he had no chance of completing that pass. But he's trying to give Johnny Knox a yeah. chance. But because it's behind him, you got D'Angelo Hall then who's breaking on the ball from the inside out. And Bell had 102 rushing yards today on oh, yeah. 18 carries. Oh, yeah. First and 10 off was for the Lions kick off. Puck ass Packers. Coming the other way, protecting the ball, and down he goes. Puck ass Packers. Alive and kicking with a big defensive play by A.J. Hawk, their linebacker, into the third quarter. As the screws tighten at Lambeau, the defense getting their hands on the ball today. They go deep. On first down for the 44. Portals under center off the plate fake. Throw it up. He has time and wobbles one to the far side. And Good it's catch. intercepted. Good catch. A one-handed grab by Correa. Or excuse me, C.J. Mosley. And Mosley <laughs> will get up to the 40-yard line. There is a flag down. C.J. Mosley made an unbelievably athletic grab on that interception. That's a good catch. Good old days, boys. Man, it's good. Oh, man. Down by 10 points. Go all the way. Touchdown. Drops straight back. Giants on a blitz. And Missy throws. Swings it right. And the pass nearly an end is intercepted by Seahorn. He's got it on the run. Down the left side of the Touch it with the 10. Five. Touchdown. What a play by Seahorn. Why they didn't show this? They should just show this version. This better quality. I can see the name. I can't even see the names on the other one. On the other clip. On the other clip. On the other clip. On the other clip. Ah, uh, this bitch ass nigga, man. Fuck Colin Kaepernick. Fuck Colin Kaepernick. Fuck Colin Kaepernick. Fuck this nigga, man. Timed it perfectly. That pass intended for Antoine Bolden. Fuck Colin Kaepernick. It's a little heat sometimes, but right here, watch him break on this football. Sees it, Kaepernick does not look him off at all, and that was a mistake. It gave Conti the jump that he needed, so now two games, and for Chris Conti, his second interception. What a spectacular play that was. Fake-ass activist. For 91 yards. And he gets it away, and it's going to be picked up at the Should've threw it out of bounds, bro. Well, why would you throw it for it? So he's clearly about to get sacked. Either, either take the sack or throw it to the out of bounds. Why the fuck would you? Why would you throw it forward? All right, Al, remember your famous line? He did what? Yeah. Watch this catch. This is a backhanded. I don't know what this is. Like, like a high. Why would catch you throw it forward? Watch this thing. Meanwhile, Bridgewater throws it left. You about to get sacked? Throw it to the side. One hand, backhanded, wraps it back around his wrist and hangs on to it. That's insane. He's just been signed by the National Highlight League. Wow. Good old days, boy. The man sport. It's a man sport. Oh. 
Yeah. You know, the quality terrible. This is a man sport. <laughs> Damn, John Madden is still on commentary. RP to John Madden. Your end zone, you have to be careful that you don't force anything. That's a heck of a play by That's Conrad a, Hamilton yeah. in not letting that ball hit the ground. You know, Wooten knocked it up in the air, and then, and then, and then Peter Wooten hit it up in the air a second time. It's a good old, it's a good old days, bro. Right? McCown for Cooks. Nope. Josh Norman. Play with the wrong one. Starting at the end of last year, his play, play with the he's got one. great so He showed skills. you. And look how long he hung in the air to pick that ball off, man. That Josh is a special Norman, play by show good, you. good, good young player. And Cook's play with the wrong like four one. Five yards on him on the sideline when the ball was released. The Dallas three for four for seven of the yards in the oh, yeah, You know this is good old days. You know this is good old days. Boy, it's a man sport. Hold on. Terrible pass. Picks off in the end zone. Sean Smith does the job. A little Velcro act down there. He brought that in with one hand. Are you kidding me? Wow, that's a heck of a play. He's a second round pick out of Utah. Sean Smith in the end zone as Brunel goes up top. Check out this Look at that. One handed, almost backhanded. And Man. both feet in bounds. It's good old days. It's like a jersey's and these. Oh, okay, it's a Pro Bowl. Oh, wow. Damn, we saw a Pro Bowl highlights? Damn. I'm about to say, what type of team is jerseys is this? Grimes took it away. That's a good ass catch. We are Manning. Let's see who he throws it to. That's a hell of a catch. That's a hell of a catch. That's a hell of a catch. Throw it up. Throw it to, <laughs> throw it to the other team, okay? He threw it to the other team. He said, I'm going to throw it long. He's like, yep, I'm going to go ahead and get it. This is as impressive a catch as I've seen. Here he is right here. Watch Patrick Peterson. This is going to be overthrown. This is going to be one-handed. It's an interception. First down. Arizona. That's a good-ass catch, too. Definitely has that right foot down. Does he get that left foot down before he goes out of bounds? One-handed. Both of them are in. And then again, control through the process of the catch as he goes to the ground with just one hand on the football. One foot. Two foot. Possession. All the way through the process. Tillman just robs Randy oh, Moss. The ball is there. It's Moss against Tillman. Oh. The ball is there for either one of them to take it. Tillman gets it. Some good old, some good old days, boy. A man sport. Got to get him up the middle. Steps away from pressure and throws down the nope. field. Give me that. It's intercepted. What an unbelievable play. By Patrick Peterson. Did he catch in number one? Once he fell down, was he touched by Chaz Schillings? What a remarkable athletic play by Patrick Peterson. Good. Yep. Trash ass Kaepernick. Intercepted by Smith. Trash ass Kaepernick. Trash as Kaepernick. Beanie Wells, the running back. Skelton rolling. Fake Beanie ass actors. Throws it away. Wow. It's caught, but I believe 
Let's see. Did they rule it? Did they rule an interception I, by Richard Sherman? It's going to be close, but I think those toes might have just tapped in. Skelton trying to throw it away. Chris Clemens on the pressure. But he didn't get it far enough out of bounds. You know what? This is just another one of those mistakes. Oh, yeah, he, he got that. What a that. job by Sherman. Yeah, a great the, call by the good replacement feet, officials. Good, good feet close, boy. Oh, yeah, good old days, boy. This is a man sport right here. This is a man sport. Woo! Knock your helmet off. This is the good old days. <laughs> oh, man, everybody catching concussions out here. This is the man sport. Hey, that's gotta be Good delivered. old days, man. Back to even hit a motherfucker and it didn't matter. Good it's a good old days, boy. It's a million sport. Oh, he, goes, he goes right at the teeth of it. We said earlier. Well, he's open there. Look at him. He was going away from it. But watch the safety Say, man. Cut it. Glenn Edwards. Say, Always motherfuckers, no, the fuck he ain't. Edwards, a good pop. It up Popped there. it right Belt out. Over yeah, here. that's, that's a good old days, boy. It's a so million sport. He makes that tackle. You saw blood slip a little bit. An exceptional rookie year in fact, so all fumbles, franchise rookies, in receptions and receiving yards, and now looking down the ground for the nope. old rumble. Good catch. That's a good catch. That's a good catch. That's a good catch. What a play by the Rams corner and Jenkins. We couldn't even see you. That, that was a fail. That was a fail. We can't even see your jersey, bro, because you long ass dread. And goal, Ryan. Angel! Nope. What an interception! Tremendous play! Dropping back from Kiko Alonso. That's where Link at the middle linebacker position shows up. A little jerk route by Roddy White. They get him one on one with Kiko Alonso. And Alonso makes a great play in pass defense for Philadelphia. Six foot four, up. he needed every inch of it to end this drive. There's a pretty fit. Going back to the Pro Bowl. And a in the air, accepted by Brent Grimes to the Falcons. Damn, y'all finna rip his damn head off, ain't you? Shit. Skelton's throw to Fitzgerald. Battle for him. Damn. Bobby Wagner has the football. And Wagner. Knocked uh, down inside the 25 of Arizona. And big clumsy Jerry motherfucker. In position to get the first down. Not a real accurate throw. Oh, good so save. Got his good save, though. Right good save, though, by number 28. Right good save. Right pull at it. It yeah, goes good down. save by Thurman 28. With his left hand bounces right into the... That's a good ass Bobby save. Wagner, who takes it down inside wow. the 14 yard line. The receivers who adjust their See, I have a Seahawks or something, ain't they? There it is. So the they got to the one yard line. Pete Carroll. There's no whistle. He's running, picking up puckers, and down at the 18 yard line. It looked like it had to hit the ground, but a couple of times it just bounced oh, it on his hand, and for the moment, it's a turnover. Well, you have all these hand signals and all this noise. You don't know. Danelle is supposed to turn and look for the ball or not, obviously. Wow. That's Eli is disgusted, and that looks like a clean interception. Ooh, ooh, well, right there at the end. Right there at the end. Oh, he, the he had it, though. He already had it. Turnover, so automatically reviewed. Right here at the end. Oh, he gets his hands underneath it. It looks like it never touched the ground. He had yes, it. They it so he had six interceptions last year. How about that? Ability to concentrate and finish the play. So they will look at it. Previous play is under review. Jay Cutler. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. They volleyball tap it. That's good. That's a good shit. Oh, wow. It appeared as though Cutler threw in to triple coverage down the middle of the field, and that is a recipe for disaster. They volleyball tap that. 19 seconds. And a new set of downs, Rivers. Oh, big boy. Big fella. Run, big fella. Run. Run, big fella. Oh. Is that Vince Wilford? Probably the first time he's running down the field going. Nope. He lost a couple pounds during the offseason, but. <laughs> 
the first pick of Wilford's career. Oh, wow. Second attempt. Hey, volleyball tap. Good. Good. Hey. And they get it right back. That's Bobby Wagner, the middle linebacker. Good shit. Seattle came in leading the league with seven turnovers. They had five last week against the 49ers. Well, this bounced right off the head of. Brad Meester, the center, and it bounced up again right there as Wagner tips it really to himself and lays out for the athletic intercept. The field here on 38 of the 33. Ryan in a shotgun. Ryan looks down the sideline. Oh, what a catch! Wow. Leon Hall went up and plucked it out the air, and all of a sudden, Cincinnati exploding off the sideline. To show some love. That's, that was a good reception. Two consecutive weeks. Number 38, Breeze. 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 Terrible oh, pass. Reception by Grimes. The run up is that he's going for Henderson and snatches it out of the air. Brent Grimes out of Shippensburg. Great interception by Brent Grimes who stepped into the line. What is his quality Brian though? Williams. Wow. Shit, recorded with a potato. What, what type of quality is this? And this is recent. This is like what, 2000, 2011, 2010. HD was around then. What type of quality is this? Brady. Damn. Intercepted inside the 10 yard line by Ricky Fontaine Davis. And Davis back across the 20 yard line. His well, second interception of the season, and it was a dandy. Well, it's exactly what Tom Brady hey, second wanted. second interception he against Tom Brady. One. No That's a hell of a story to tell. Randy Moss and yeah, a rookie. Yeah, my second interception. You wouldn't know I got my second he interception. He identifies it, goes right Tom to it. Tom Brady. But the Ooh, ball line. is just a shade Copy under throw. Copy it on throat, YouTube right there. that is 99% Vontae Davis. Look at him out-elevate Randy Moss. Hey, you took it from Randy Moss. For the football, and that was oh, that's a good-ass story to tell right there. Advantage rookie. That's a good-ass story to tell right oh, there. Second and nine. Davis sidearms and it's tipped away. Oh, wow. Good. Oh, wow. Patrick Peterson throwing it for the Cardinals. Touchdown. Brian Hoyer subbing for the injured Johnny Manziel but out the first half with a hamstring injury. But a throw on first down. Throws long again. And do that. Yep, just like the Cleveland Browns, ain't it? Just like the Cleveland Browns. Oh no, did he fumble? The Browns got it back. Travis Benjamin. Who couldn't come up with a reception, came all the way back and was able to take down Josh Norman and the ball came loose. But what a play, first of all, by Norman. The ball skills. Yeah, why would you hold the football like that? You're supposed to tuck it, my brother. You tuck it. You tuck it. Fucking idiot. Oh, yeah. Go all the way. Go all the way. Go all the way. It's all you. Ain't nobody going to catch you. Ain't nobody going to catch you. Look at that. That's some good shit. Oh, this is back in the good old days, boy. It's a man sport. Hasselback has that one. Matt Hasselback. And then Roy Williams with the pick, and he stayed inbounds and intercepts it at the 43 yard line. Now, again, Roy Williams catches the ball. But did that right foot step out of bounds? He's the same as a receiver at this point. The same thing applies. It looks as if his right foot's on the line. And this is going to be clearly a challenge for Mike Holmgren. Commercial break. Roy Williams. And this is the best shot, believe it or not, from the old 22 camera up above. 
Left foot down. He has possession. Right foot appears to be inbound. Now there's a little bit of this green inbound. on the left in between inbound. the chalk. This is so Bell. He remains the running back on first and ten. Bortles play action. Wanted to go deep, not from there. Now fires, and that pass is deflected. Woo! Picked up by Bobby Richardson. The rookie defensive end with the first interception of his career. Oh, yeah, good old days, boy. Man, sport. Steve McNair. <laughs> Go out of way. Go out of way. Ray Lewis. It's a man sport. It's a good old one of the man sport. Why would you throw the cover? I understand it. I understand it's Fitzgerald, but why throw the coverage? That is only the fourth interception thrown this year by Palmer. It looked like he tried to force it in there. Yeah. He's trying to fit one into Jermaine Gresham, and the ball comes off of him. And Lawrence Timmons does just an excellent job of being aware and knowing where the ball is. And the catch that he why would you just throw it in coverage like that, though? All righty, so that's just going to end it off right here for right now. I'll see you on the next video. Till then, peace out.